Hello, welcome back. We continue to review the textbook construction materials, methods, and techniques building for a sustainable future. This video is about chapter 19, and that is products manufactured from wood. So um, the, this chapter talks about the technical information on industrial plywood to make construction specification decisions. Then we'll also see how we can select the appropriate reconstituted wood panel products for various applications and see how people categorize and select hardwood plywood for construction applications. Also, there is a subchapter dedicated to identifying and choosing engineered wood structural components used for building constitution. And we'll take a look at the types of construction products manufactured from wood. So you know that there are engineered wood products and uh, this is what this chapter is actually about. Let's take a look at the plywood and other panel products. So there is the plywood panel construction and that is um, the standard four by eight sheets and we've been manufactured this for like a century. And uh, those are made from water saturated um, layers um, bonded together. Um, and those are thin layers of pl uh, plies uh, of wood. And the grain in each ply layer is arranged perpendicular to the grain of the next layer. So that's why the structural integrity is better. Um, so also we need to understand the uh, construction in industrial plywood. So there are different grades, there are different species, there are different sizes of the panels. And also there are veneer grades in I refer to the textbook. You can see the pictures in the charts. Uh, so there is also, um, there are also different types. Uh, one is plywood, then APA rated siding, then composite or comply and oriented strand board or OSB. Um, so when we talk about specialty plywood, uh, there are different panels for interior applications as the finished material and other architectural products as well, not just the structural. Uh, hardwood plywood is made using various species of hardwood veneers for the face and back surfaces of the panel and they're bonded to plywood or, or, or particle board panels that form the core. So again, refer to the images, please, and you can see different species and different grades as well. And there are also reconstituted wood products. Um, so for example, hardboard is made from wood chips converted into fibers and bonded into panels under the heat and pressure and manufactured following standards developed by the American Hardboard Association. Uh, so take a look at different grades here. You can see the trademarks that APA um, has uh, created the Engineered Wood Association. Uh, and let's take a look at the subchapter structural building components. So, uh, what we can uh, use the lumber or the wood for is uh, we can uh, use it for structural composite lumber or SCL. And that is the lumber manufactured by parallel orientation of wood fibers of various geometries bonded with the structural adhesive. And there is a glue laminated wood members or glue lamb. Uh, they are formed of solid sawn lumber that is finger jointed and to end and then face bonded in laminations. Also, there is the LVL or laminated veneer lumber and that is uh, produced by bonding thin wood veneers together into a large um, piece. So also, 
uh, you can see here the uh, parallel strand lumbar or PSL. Uh, that is a relatively new product that utilizes almost all of the wood from solid logs and it's manufactured under um, the registered name Parallel. So, and it's um, made from Douglas fir or Southern pine. Uh, I'm sure you've seen those products um, and you are aware of those. So also there is a case study here in the chapter. That's the Aldo Leopold Legacy Center. It's quite interesting to see. Um, and um, the um, uh, final subchapter here is um, just reviewing the other products manufactured from wood. And it could be wood shingles and shakes and they're very popular. Uh, windows, uh, they're still used, wooden windows. Also cabinets are generally made from wood and wood products. Um, and also uh, finished flooring and some other applications. And of course, uh, furnishings and um, some uh, equipment and appliances. So that was it for the uh, chapter 19. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in chapter 20 and we'll talk about wooden metal light frame construction. Thank you.